in order to install the vcs cluster software we will invoke the same installer script but this time we will choose a different option so let's go to the dvd1 red hat linux directory by typing cd dvd1 red hat linux here we will navigate to our hell 7 directory by pressing tab key for the completion with the half name press enter now we will execute the installer script again by dot forward slash installer and then enter key the same installation program has begun again here from the options we will select i for the installation press enter for the products we need veritas info scale enterprise we will select number four now the installer is asking if we want to configure the enterprise software after the installation in our case we don't want to configure it we will configure it later so i will say no and then press enter we have to agree with the license terms used we will say yes now here we will provide our server names which will be the part of the cluster so i will say server 1 space server 2 and then press enter the installer program is running those prerequisite checks again there are eight tasks this may take a while but we will wait for it to finish okay so the installer is showing us the cpi kernel warning again we will ignore this warning and then we will say yes to continue now you can see the installer will go through 29 different tasks to make sure the Veritas InfoScale Enterprise cluster server is up and running. We have to wait for the installation process to finish up. Then we will configure our clusters. Okay, our installer program has finished installing the software now it's asking us to enter the license key or we can use a 60 day trial since we don't have the license key i will select option number two and then press enter here the installer is asking which product we want to license these systems for we will select number four which is veritas infoscale enterprise press the enter key and now both of our servers are successfully registered for the product we chose if you want you can view the installation summary by pressing y and then press enter these were the packages which were installed on server 1 and in server 2 in the next lecture we will configure our cluster i will see you in the next lecture then thank you